Hey guys, Ben here from Nick and Ben's Fishing Adventures. Snuck out for a little waiting trip. It's gonna be a quick trip. Uh, I'm gonna keep an eye on the radar. There's a storm just north of here. I don't think it's gonna get here, but, but we'll see. But I'm gonna stick right around this access and this cool bridge here. It's an old bridge, it's kinda cool. I've never been on this part of the river before. So we're gonna give it a try. back in that little pocket maybe he'll come come after it again oh there he is right there he just swam out of there there he's going for it again there he hit it <laughs> oh, that's cool. I hope you guys can see that on the GoPro. Let's get him, man. That's fun. Yeah, that's a nice one. A good way to start off the evening. Oh, ho, ho, look at that! Oh, that's fun! Unbelievable! Hey, I saw him to eat it all the way. Huh. How awesome is that? So he was sitting right back up in there. There's that little pocket. And he might have bit it once or another one bit it. And then swam out along this edge and ate it right there. So just right back in there, not very deep at all. So we'll see, this is where I've been catching them. Shallow, up on cover. So right up there looks really good. <laughs> They're really relating to that cover right now. It's going to give me a good chance to find a big one, hopefully. Nice fish. There he goes. <laughs> right back over there. <laughs> Starting to sprinkle just a little bit, so I'm probably going to put the GoPro away for a minute. See if I can fish these last two spots. There's one. Not going to turn it off quite yet. That's what I was waiting for. This is a nice fish. Let's hope he stays on. Sure, let's see what we got here. This is a nice one. Come on, stay on. Get the rain coming with the GoPro. I can turn him a little bit. Stay on, buddy. Oh yeah, that's a 
It's a nice little chunky one. I'll grab him up. It's a perfect fighter size. He really, really ate the jig too. He ain't coming off. Just grab him up real quick. A fighter, healthy fish, big, big time fighter. Let's get him back in the water. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's got energy. All right, GoPro is going off for a minute while a right little rainstorm comes through. And I'll probably keep fishing. I'm just kind of chilling here. I got my log I'm sitting on, fishing rod, just waiting. Uh, there was a little bit of red just to the west of here on the radar. So I'm just going to kind of chill, sit under this tree and wait till it passes. Well, since I'm just waiting out, last little bit of rain i suppose i could talk about the bait i'm using uh, this is a pepper custom baits micro jig and i have the berkeley jigger craw on there and the three inch and it's been a amazing bait for me i've caught more big bass on it here in iowa than any other bait not even close last night i was out with my son and we were catching crawdads and minnows and stuff like that the crawdads were this almost this exact green pumpkin and then they had a black in there too so i switched up the color of my bait today and uh, seems to be working all right i think the weather's passed uh, normally i don't mind fishing in the rain but there was just a little bit of red on the radar a few miles away so I set it out and was careful and just going to fish a little bit more before heading home. Yep, <laughs> another nice one. Look at that smallie. Look at that one. Wow, another nice one. Awesome fish. All right, let's put him back. Wow, oh, look at him go there. He's just chilling. He looks pretty big in the water. There he goes. Yep, nice one. Fish on. Not as big as the other ones, but still a nice fish. That one might be as big as the other ones. Nope, don't go in those trees. Come on out of there. There we go, bring them up around here. And they are on the jig tonight. There he is. These ones just got a lot of fight in them. Come here, buddy. That's fun. I don't know if they're just strong or what, but that 16 inch fish, ooh, look at that. This looks phenomenal. Little fighter here. All right, 
Don't need to measure him, but I'll put him back. You can tell we're in Iowa because there's some corn stalks in the river. All right, well, that's going to wrap it up for me this evening. It's getting dark fast, so I'm going to hightail it back to the launch. See you next time.